I'm here with uh, Mr. Tim McClinic, a man of many hats here at Surtech Solutions Survey and Mapping, Tampa, Florida. Thanks for being here, Tim. No problem, Dwight. Thanks. Let's start with your background, Tim. Where are you from originally? Uh, like, what school did you go to, and what did you major in? Well, Dwight, I grew up in uh, a suburb of Detroit, Michigan, and I went to Michigan State University in East Lansing, Michigan. I got a mathematics degree and I also had some specialized courses in geographic information systems. Now, how did your, your degree in mathematics, how has that played into helping you here at ServTech? Well, it's been a, been a great help. I, between my combination of mathematics classes and my GIS classes, it seems to fit perfectly into the surveying role. I've been able to grow my myself and my abilities here at ServTech along with the company. Now here's a big question, Tim. What are all of your duties here at ServTech? I know, you know we just said you, you're a man of many hats. Well, um, uh, my primary responsibilities would be the CAD and GIS technicians, um, taking the raw data from the field and turning them into finished surveys, whether it be um, a CAD paper survey or a JS, and when the necessity calls, I also go out and help the guys out in the field. Yeah, and, and you also do the, uh, the laser scanning as well. That is true. <laughs> what does the SurfTech company motto, surveying today with tomorrow's technology, mean to you personally? Well, to me personally, it means that uh, we are on like, the cutting edge. If there's a piece of equipment or software out there that we feel will be beneficial to us and to, the, to our clients, will uh, utilize that technology to try to keep us the most efficient and top-of-the-line products. Very good. Going one step further with that, what are some of the ways that you see our motto in practice here at Surtech Solutions? Well, like you had mentioned, we, we have a 3D laser scanner now. Uh, so we're out there, we're scanning what needs to be scanned and we'll turn out another high-quality product to our clients. And Tim, you literally have experiences in, in all types of surveying. For you personally, what do you find the most challenging and also the most rewarding out of the projects you've completed here at ServTech? Is there a particular type of surveying that, that you really enjoy doing or a particular type of drafting or a particular piece of technology? Um, I don't know about a particular type, but the particular project that seems to give me the most satisfaction is when there's a, a project that uh, a client seems to have difficulty with whether it's a difficult boundary survey or you know they have some sort of conflict with their with their neighbor and they need us to go out there and dig deep and you know get to the bottom of what the real issue is and when we're able to do that and satisfy the client that's pretty satisfying yeah and, and you seem to really be a, a problem solver type person do you find that CERTEC is a good place to exercise your problem-solving abil abilities? Absolutely. I, I, I must be like something about problem-solving with a math degree. So. <laughs> right. <laughs> uh, yeah, it, seem, it seems like uh, it's a good place to be to be able to work on that and actually solve the problems as opposed to sweeping them under the rug and moving on to the next. Mm -hmm. yeah, and I think that's one of the things that sets CERTEC apart as far as a land surveying firm. Absolutely. Now, Tim, as we move forward, where do you see Surtech Solutions, and furthermore, where do you see yourself in the future? I see uh, Surtech as being one of, if not the top premier land surveying company out there, being able to offer services that not all surveying companies can, and definitely being able to offer a better product in the end than most surveyors can. And personally for me, I, I see myself being able to acquire my license and joining the licensed staff here at ServTech. Absolutely. Well, that's great. That's fantastic. Is there anything else you'd like to add or like to close with here, Tim? I believe that pretty much sums it up the way. Thanks. Well, Tim, I want to thank you for being here, and I want to thank you for all that you do at ServTech. Uh, you're, you're a great guy, and uh, I, I really hope that we will see you in the licensed staff, and I'm sure that that's something that, that's definitely going to happen. So thanks for speaking with me. Thanks, Dwight. Thanks for having me.